Mm -hmm. No, I think I'm. I think I'm be all right. I think I'm just trying to figure it out. Um, you know, just trying to figure out how to how to play alongside Dane a little bit. So it's the first time playing with each other. So um, it's a different kind of dynamic from last year because obviously I was like the primary ball handler at all times. So it's just trying to figure out how to you know pick my spots as well as be myself and shoot the ball. So um, I'm out there just trying to figure out you know different times where I can you know. Um, Play, play my game and, and kind of do what the team needs me to do as well. You don't want to sort of overplay your hand like maybe you did the last two months last year because they back. Yeah, I mean, it's, it, yeah, it's, it's, it's going to be, it's obviously going to be different because, you know, most of the time the team is looking for me to, to initiate everything and, you know, an outlet, they're looking for me. So they're like, it's, it's hard because now we got two people that can do the same thing. So now it's kind of a split time and in that time where I had full time. So now it's like, you know, trying to figure out, you know, different ways so I can impact the game, you know, um, alongside of obviously Dame going to do what, what Dame does. So I'm just trying to f figure out where I can gel in and, and play my part as well. Mm -hmm. Defensively last night, you got caught up on Kawhi a couple of different times. They tried to kind of exploit you. Chauncey said that one of the things that he was happy with last night was how well you stood up in those performances. And then tonight, he said he was pretty happy with your as his primary actions. Just need some work on the secondary stuff. With that starting group, how are you guys kind of coming together, and how are you feeling about your, your individual performances in those you know, cross matches and those situations? Yeah, like it was a big emphasis in training camp, learning, you know, knowing how to switch one through five. And um, I think we've been been carrying that, you know, throughout these preseason games. You know, like last game, we, we did pretty well in the switches with, with Nurk, and even tonight we did pretty well in the switches. And it's just communication, honestly, um, just trusting each other. I think we, we've been trying to gain that through training camp in the past couple games where we have an understanding of, you know, who we want to be as a team and how we're going to switch and how we're going to be aggressive in those times. So um, I think the versatility on, you know, different coverages we can play it will be to our advantage. How did you feel about those moments down there with Kawhi, though? Because he came out stronger. I know. I was, I was, I was surprised myself, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. You. I mean, you see Kawhi like moving centers. You know what I mean? So it's like when I was able to take at least three bumps from him and, and be okay, I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, I guess weight room you know, help working out, I guess. Does that reinforce it for you mentally to have that experience against a guy like Kawhi who's 245 and you're able to? Yeah, for to sure. Give me, that. yeah. That's something, you know, somebody, nobody could take away from me. Yeah, I got <laughs> I got a couple of stops on Kawhi a little bit. <laughs> In the post, no doubt. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Uh, Chauncey wanted you, I'll go back to what we talked about earlier. Chauncey wanted you last year to really think about being a point guard and a playmaker and demonstrate that, get back to back 11 assist performances. And now you have to kind of go back to being more of a two guard mentality, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is that tough to do or is that falling back to what you kind of you were? Yeah, it's like that's 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 the thing I'm trying to figure out is kind of balance. You know, also carry with the things that I've learned last year onto this year as well as, you know what I mean, I might be, you know what I mean, falling into a two guard role sometimes and in that times where I'm in the in the game with Dame. So um, kind of balancing the two and, you know, being aggressive and also playing my game and letting, like how I usually play last year is letting the game come to me, pick my spots and make good plays and get everybody else involved. So, um, like I said, that's probably the thing that I'm trying to figure out as we go through these preseason games. What are your impressions so far, Jeremy? Nah, Jeremy's, you know, I mean, as good as advertised. You know what I mean? I think, like I said before the season, it's some, somebody that we, we never had. And um, just athleticism is, you know, his versatility on both ends of the floor. Um, he's very active and, you know what I mean, just something that obviously, like I said, we haven't had before. So I'm glad that, you know, he's able to come in and, you know, put his stamp on the team early um, like he has. With so many, do you chalk up uh, turnovers to just preseason play or do you feel like you guys are maybe trying to be extra aggressive on the offensive end? Or? It could be kind of both. Um, obviously, a lot of guys, you know what I mean, are amped up. So what I mean, those those come as well, and also just trying to get a feel for each other, um, you know, knowing what it's supposed to be in, and kind of just getting a, getting you know a little bit of a communication on how we want to play. So um, you know, it's kind of both. Obviously, a lot of people are amped up, like I said, and some some of it's just figuring each other out and getting the real chemistry. So um, I think it's kind of both. Do you uh, do you try things? You might, I mean, you didn't really have to just go try something. Do you, do you try stuff kind of preseason? Maybe wouldn't try necessarily or be so quick to try in the regular season? Um, not really. I mean, 
personally, I'm I'm a more conservative player, but uh, <laughs> uh, usually I'm just in the preseason. I'm just trying to get in the rhythm of the shots I'm going to take in the end of the season. So I'm just taking those shots, whether it's pick and roll threes, uh, maybe some pull up twos, floaters. Those are the things I'm trying to get get back into the groove in because you know I didn't see a lot of those things in preseason because I would play aggressive on the pick and roll. So. I'm just trying to get back into the rhythm of, you know, shooting, shooting, pull up threes. I was pick and roll and get into the lane easy, easier than we did in the training camp. So um, those are the things I'm just mostly working on in the preseason, getting the rhythm in that. With some of you guys uh, on the roster, and guys that you're playing with in a, in a different role, how much of it is not necessarily difficult, but different for you to balance trying to get that new shot diet, getting feet in the paint, shot attempts at the rim, and, and breaking the defense down versus trying to find where guys are going to find those natural cuts, like a, a Nasir or a Josh or, or Jeremy. When you're going through and going through your reads, how does that kind of progress for you trying to balance those things? Um, just, I think, I mean, you got to you gotta go out there and try to do it each and, each and every time and have a, a good communication with Nasir of, or anybody else on what what needs to be done. I think as we continue, like, you know, me driving in the paint, Nasir in the corner, if it's a perfect time for him to cut, then, then – you know, he has to. We have to have a communication on when it's time and when it's not. Um, so I think it's just based off. I mean, that's what the reason we have preseason games is to be able to, you know, communicate those things out and and, and learn from those mistakes that we make and you know learn from you know the good things that we do do in the, in the preseason. So um, I think you know just learning learning each other throughout these couple of games. It's going to be big for us because now we're going to have a good momentum going into the season and how we want to play and how we, you know, want to carry out the season. Do you feel like you're talking more and taking one. taking more action in those situations on the floor now? Yeah, for sure. I mean, um, obviously, like I said last year, you know, I mean, I had to be more com communicate a lot more uh, out there on the court. So um, this year is, is no different. You know, what I mean, just being out there, communicating anything, and you know, making sure everybody's on the same on the same wave. So. Um, you know, I think going to the preseason games, I think we're going to continue to build trust with each other and, um, you know, get better from there.